I do think that Rust is is, is pretty interesting. We chose Rust because uh, we thought that it would kind of lower the barrier to entry for people who wanted to contribute uh, to high performance, you know, languages. It, it can be very intimidating to come to a new code base and go like, what are all these C plus plus like macros, like different, you know. Uh, uh, different standards across different code bases, but Rust is very opinionated. And so it makes it very easy for someone to come in. And I think Rust is extremely, extremely compatible with Python. There's a uh, Rust to Python library called PyO3 that's extremely good. One example is actually if you pass a NumPy array into Rust, it appears natively in Rust as like a view of like the, the integers, which is amazing. In C++, it's like, I don't know if you've ever worked with PyBind, but oh my oh, goodness. God nightmares yeah, yeah. right and i think that really just has <laughs> yeah so that just it en it enables a developer who wants to build for the python ecosystem but then wants to build high performance tooling i think that's the real power so it's not really about whether or not we're all going to move to rust i think it's more this general theme of data moving to a world where we have sql and python and then what's right. really powerful for python today is that rust ecosystem